In today's episode, we'll be discussing the alien invasion. We'll also be waiting for the Tanky Fund giveaway and sharing esports news. Hello, tankers! The 10 million tank coin giveaway from the Tanky Fund is rapidly approaching. And before we find out who wins the prizes, we would like to remind everyone that you still have a chance to become a participant in the giveaway. Next week, we will have a live stream to raffle away all these tank coins. For more information, click on the link in the description. A year has passed since the last time aliens visited the tanky universe. If you see meteor showers and an alien pilot instead of your drone, it means that they are back. To welcome our friends, we have prepared a usual UFO day program, including sales, special offers and game modes. Starting from June 25th and lasting till July 4th, we will have festive decorations, ultra containers and coin boxes during this event. Fridays, Saturdays and Sundays will also feature boosted funds and experience. This will make it easier to complete four special missions and a super mission, which we have prepared for you with the following prizes. The aliens have also brought two special offers to your shopping cart, available at 50% discount. The Speed of Light and Dark Matter bundles will be both available during the event. There are also discounts for those who have accumulated a few thousand tank coins or crystals. 30% on the shop items today. 30% in the garage on Saturday and 30% on upgrades and 50% on the speedups on Sunday. And as soon as you upgrade your tank, you can go straight to the special modes. This time, both of them are in the deathmatch mode. The first special mode will be in the game from June 25th till June 27th on Yorkshire, Solikomsk and Kungur. The second will start on July 2nd and finish on July 4th and will feature the desert, stadium and Parma maps, with overdrives disabled. Be cautious, they say that when aliens come to our universe, gold boxes turn into meteorites, and when they fall they destroy everything around, destroy others, and take a gold box or a container waiting for you in the meteorites crater. It's time for a Blitz Q&A session with Hazel. How can I enter a promo code in the mobile version? Unfortunately, there's no such option in the mobile version of the game at the moment, but we're working on updating its interface, so this feature will be added. Will you add an instant or partial upgrade to rewards like containers, challenges, gifts, etc.? They would work like Joker cards in Clash Royale. We have a different system for upgrades. Their prices and time needed vary, depending on how much you have already upgraded an item. Thus, we won't be able to add a full analog copy of this Joker card. Will you update the TO Mobile's interface? Yes, we are working on it. We would like to make all PC features available for mobile players. Will there be a dynamic suspension on track hulls? We have already made it possible on the new HD hull scans, but this feature is not currently activated. We are working on implementing skeletal animation technology that will make it possible to activate this feature. Are you going to bring back the test drive feature that lets you play a battle with an item equipped so you can check it out before buying it? No. Do you plan on adding more tan coins to weekly containers? We do not have such plans. Will there be more Wasp and Firebird special modes in the near future? Of course, you liked it, didn't you? Are you planning to add an in-game option which will allow clan leaders to change the names of their clan and its tag? Yes, we do have such plans. Moreover, it would also be good to add options to change a clan leader and increase the number of players in a clan. Are you aware of all those lags that are being even more visible by each event? Will you do something about it? Yep, our team is aware of them and we're trying to fix them. Why did you change the upgrade system? This update has ruined the micro upgrades. I don't see the point of these changes. The previous system was too hard to understand, and we had two systems simultaneously. We have decided to make it easier for new players to understand by merging them. The second season of the Tanky Sport 2021 has finished, and the finals were breathtaking. For three hours, Revenge and Bandwins couldn't determine who was stronger. There were even additional rounds after the main ones. And if the Revenge clan hadn't captured a flag two minutes before the end, who knows how many hours the battle might have lasted. Congratulations to the winners, and it's time to take a rest from clan tournaments. While the top teams will be enjoying a month without matches, it's the best time to enter esports. We have opened registration for two tournaments. Solo TOF 
for the virtuosos of playing with the Ricochet Turret and Trio Masters of the Sword Tournament for teams of 3 to 4 Railgun players. Hurry and sign up to take part, because clans are closely monitoring the results of these battles in search of new faces for their teams. Who knows, maybe in a month it will be you who will not only become the owner of the unique Gladiator paint, but also join the roster of one of the top teams. All links are in the description. Welcome back to YouTuber Digest, our weekly selection of the best TO videos created by players. Have you seen Tesla in action? If you haven't yet, watch Goges, as he made a cool gameplay video about Tesla. If you're looking for cool gold box catches, watch the Gold Hunter's 30th gold box hunting video. Quick note, if you want to be featured in the YouTuber Digest, Fill out the YouTuber wannabe form and show us your best video. The link to the form can be found in the description. That's all for today. Oh, wait, one more thing. We have created a special forum topic to collect questions for developers. Short and simple questions will be answered in the Blitz Q&A session of the Vlog, and others will be answered in the special Q&A session videos with Hazel. By the way, next week we're gonna have it instead of the Vlog on July 2nd. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to be the first to know when new videos are released. And before you go, don't forget to smash the like button as well. Bye. Last time, you had to guess how many tanks would be immobilized after Strikers shot. The correct answer is B. Congratulations to the winners. And here is the next question.